Hi guys, we are going to take a look at this Daniel Smith set, uh, Serene 2 Dramatic. I bought it recently on Arte Miranda because it was on sale and I really wanted to have, where is it? Ah, here it is, Sleeping Beauty. I saw that this color, it's quite expensive and I think I would have never bought it. Um, like in a tube just one color to pay so much nope i don't think so so that's why i decided to buy this set and let's take a look at it and i'm gonna swatch this set wait do i open it here no actually i need to open it on the side so we have a daniel smith sticker there What do we get here? A swatch chart. So this is the one that I got now. I already um, swatched a couple of these sets using my dot card. And I think I will just now swatch this one beside all the other uh, sets so that you guys can see what colors come in these different sets. And Hmm, let's open it, let's open it. Oh, it's a little bit harder to open, I don't know why, but here it is. Yeah, it's just a small, small set, but I love it. So how many colors? How many places? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So I can put nine colors in here. Hmm, that is an um, interesting idea. Right now, I've put them, so the, the colors that I have in this core box, and here they are. So they are not all Daniel Smith. That's why I'm thinking maybe I will really take them out from here and put them in this so I have one two three four five six seven eight nine let me check I have to check if this is yeah yep I have more I have more but I think so I have here the queen rose what is this a rose of ultramarine but I'm thinking I will probably put here this one. I think that one was, that one is um, Green Appetite Genuine and maybe also this one. What was this one? 109. That, was it. that one is Undersea Green. So I think these two could actually fit nicely inside of uh, this set. What else did I get? Paints gray, indigo, cerulean blue, lunar blue. Do I have lunar blue? Hmm, I have something like that. Soda light, <gasps> soda light genuine. Oh, that one. Okay, Sleeping Beauty. Um, soda light genuine, I think was the one color that I liked the last time when I was doing the swatch from my dot card so yeah i i really think that i am let's see let's see if those ones can actually fit inside if they do not fit inside this one should fit because this is the original one and this one i'm not sure it's not an original pen but it fits great that's nice okay and the rest here, these are the cores, and all of these ones are Holbein. And if you're asking yourself, what is this? Well, there was a time where, when on AliExpress you were able to buy like these small sets of Daniel Smith color. Uh, I'm now actually pretty sure that it is a real Daniel Smith color. That time, at that time, I was not sure, but I compared some of these colors with the ones on the dot card and they just they look the same so no difference there so yeah so here are the other sets that i swatched as i said i'm using only like this dot card and i'm swatching the sets so it was really fun to do that uh, 
I made one mistake in this uh, swatching, it was here. I swatched the tallow blue red shade instead of the green shade. So in this set, you actually get the green shade. Well, okay, I'm gonna clean this up and start with the swatching. So let's put a little bit of the water. And now see how this sleeping beauty color looks like. It activates really nice. No problem there. It also flows nicely. It is a nice color. So the next in the set is a cerulean blue. And this one activates nicely as well. Uh, it's not flowing so much. Maybe I will take a little bit more of water. Let's just see. Nope. Like, it's okay, but it does not really flow so much. Okay. The next one, also granulating color, is Lunar Blue. Some of these pens are like really full and some of them are not like this lunar blue definitely has less color than the sleeping beauty wow this is like it's a nice color it's like really really nice deep rich color but it's not flowing a lot the next one is indigo and indigo is not granulating Whoa, it's a strong, oh, I love it, I love it. Really strong color, really dark. And then we have Sodalite Genuine. So let's put that one here. Oh, the Sodalite Genuine, as you can see, this pen is really full. And this one is flowing. Okay. And the last one, not granulating color, is Paints Blue Gray. Ooh. Let's see about this one. Well, this one also looks really dark. So we will see when when it when they dry how they look like. As you can see the colors are really vibrant and they have you have here a color separation in these two. These two are really strong. I'm happy with my buy. Okay, so this is going to be quite interesting. I just did a really quick sketch and how, what should I tell you? I'm only gonna use these colors. We'll see what will come out of it. Maybe nothing, maybe something. So yeah, let's, let's just take a look and see what we get here. I think I'm gonna work like in the opposite directions. Uh, the upper part, I definitely would need a larger brush, but right now I just do not feel um, like searching for a right brush. I'm just gonna just gonna paint a little bit, like nothing special, and we will see what will happen. So um, for. This is gonna be like, I'm not sure, like a river or something. So just gonna put a little bit of the color. Probably here a little bit more. Ah, 
yeah, maybe I can. I was not thinking about it, but I sh I am gonna put it a little bit also here. Okay, so for the sky, the sky is gonna be tricky uh, because I do not have anything for me to paint the moon or something. So I am gonna improvise a little bit. Okay, so, oh, it's already dry. The paper almost already dried out. And I need a couple of colors here actually. So this one is only here. And I am gonna clean this up a little bit like this. And what color do I need? I need something dark. Oh, wait, 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 maybe this one, this one, this one is a, is a granulating color. I think this one is gonna work nice here. Maybe also here. Ah, that was maybe too much. I actually want to have it darker in the corners. So I'm gonna take a bit of this indigo color and put that one, yeah, yeah, that is what I wanted. I wanted this part to be like really dark. Okay. And let's see. So this, I should have started this later, not now. I have to be careful what I'm doing because I have a lot of water here. I should have started the other way around, but it's okay. It's okay. Um, this one, this one here is also... I need to make the brighter parts first. Ah, yes, now I know. Now I know what I'm gonna do. So, this mountain here... Yeah, and this part here are gonna be with that lunar blue and maybe also this one, this part, yes. Yeah, it's okay if they mix a little bit, it's fine. Actually, this is also a nice color. Hmm. Could also leave it like that. Let's see the lunar blue. I think I took the right color. Right now I'm not so sure. I think I did. Mm -hmm. And the lunar blue is also going to this mountain here. Like this. Yeah, that's nice. I like this. Then we will have again like a dark part here. Okay. And then this one as well. Mm-hmm. 
but again also here yeah i should be more careful but it's fine it's fine let's just let's mix these nice colors together okay and this one what should i make this one which color should that one be well i i think it needs to be pale but maybe what kind what what was this soda light janine let's try the soda light janine so i will i should have cleaned my brush better i have here a lot of uh, lunar blue no but maybe it will work okay mm -hmm. so here i'm gonna mix a little bit of the blue because i want to have something brighter in between just a little bit like okay then this one here I think I need somehow something something as you guys can see I'm not really mixing colors uh, but I do this here needs to be brighter yeah it needs to be bright as well as this part here but hmm, I did not use the in was it indigo the last one no paints blue blue gray well it is it is still strong but maybe if i do it like this it could work yeah okay I will need to put here some more shadows, but I will do that afterward. Okay, so I think now I have to do something here. This one needs to have a little bit darker because this is like some kind of stones here. It will be much darker, but not right now. Right now I need to maybe put I think this one yeah this is the paints gray and I definitely want this part here to be dark okay like also here needs to go there mm -hmm then what else ah yes that one here needs to be dark then this part here okay mm, this one is i think i want to yeah i can, i will probably do this later but I need some some um, trees here otherwise it makes no sense okay and I don't like this here nope somehow I, I definitely do not like this one this up here so I'm gonna yeah, I think that is better. Okay. And 
think this part also needs to be a bit darker it's just somehow too too bright yeah like this i think that is okay okay and also the river i was waiting because this is still wet so i still need to wait a little bit or maybe i can let me see pick up a little bit of this color and later do the rest This here needs to be darker, this part. Maybe not as dark as I am putting it now, but... It has to be. Yeah, it's a little bit too much. I'm just gonna wipe it off. This strong, this color is really strong. This indigo one. So I'm gonna clean it up a bit. It's just too much. It's nice. It's okay, but just too much. And uh, what was this one? This sort of like genuine. Hmm, yeah, okay. Let's do this one. Wow, it's like, it's like, just like black color. Mm. But as you guys can see, I'm actually not using a palette now. Other, otherwise, I would have used like a palette to put some colors, some nice colors down and mix them. But right now, I'm, I'm not really using a palette here. Okay. So what I think is that I need here, nope, I need more, I need a darker, a little bit darker color here. Like, da -da 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 -da. like something like this. Okay. I just want this part to really be dark. Yeah. 
yeah, like that. Okay, so let's take the tape off. Ta -da. Ta -da. So I think it looks really nice considering I was not really paying attention uh, and was just like sketching. To, I sketched this like in, a, in one minute and was not really using any palette to make my colors a little bit brighter to water them down so i was really only using uh, this uh, set that came so guys i hope you like it thank you for watching and see you next time bye